To build your DIY seismograph, you'll need a cardboard box, string, a disposable cup, coins, a pen or a pencil, scissors, and some paper. Step one, with the help of an adult, poke some holes in top of a cardboard box and remove one of the side panels. In the inset video, you can find a technique on how to prepare the cup that we're going to need later in the video. Step two, feed a length of string down into one of the upper holes and then back up through the other upper hole. This may be tricky. It's good to make sure that the ends of the string are secured and that there's some slack underneath the lid. Step three, connect your disposable cup that's been cut down a little bit to the string. You can experiment with different attachment methods and see which one works best for you. As in the inset video below. Step four, insert your pen or pencil into the cup through a hole that you have cut at the bottom. Step five, you wanna fill your cup with some coins this is to help damp the motion so that we get the motion just of the moving table. Then finally, step six, insert your paper. Earthquake. You probably don't want it to shake that much. But you can experiment with different shaking amounts, different shaking styles. And if you happen to have a smartphone ready with the MyShake app running, you can even create your own seismogram by moving the piece of paper with time and watching how your recording compares to the sensor on the phone. Setup is not always easy. Keep trying. 